quick sterilizing of the press cage prior to use give it a nice warm bath might jump in myself Does that look good? It's a wine bar. Smells yummy. Yeah. So we're pressing away. Look at that. Look at it. Can you smell it? Yeah, what does it smell? Oh, it's great. <laughs> so the filthy good Vino bathtub wine making project is reaching its end. <laughs> it's pressing time. There's a child showing us how it's done. She's got the bucket work under control. The basket press is going to have its second workout for the day. <laughs> and happiness will prevail. I was talking then. Pressing time for the filthy good vino bathtub wine making project. Tresna in action on the bar. Shane uh, casually watching on with a remote control and uh, Genevieve uh, just supervising really. Nice work. Filthy Good Vino Bathtub Wine Making Project is uh, heading down into the gutter as we speak, but we're, we're, we're trying to press the, the last of the uh, last of the skins out at the moment. We've got Tresna on the uh, the ratchet and, uh, and Shane holding it steady, and, uh, and, and slowly we've got some beautiful pressings coming out. They're all being blended off into the tank, and uh, it's, it's tasting really good. We're happy with the way it's come off. Everyone's got big smiles. I think there'll be uh, a little bit of boogie coming up shortly. Say hi, Tresna. Hi. <laughs> Say hi, Shane. Say hi, Marie. Hi. <laughs> See you for the next pressing section of the filthy good vino bathtub while making poker. Don't worry, it's fine. As long as it doesn't break. Even if it does break, we'll put more in. The blood runs thick. Jesus flowing beautifully.